Alright guys, today we're going to be talking about RAM allocation. So this is another one of those things that I see uh, quite a bit on the Reddit, or not the Reddit, the Discord server, is people don't know how to set RAM to their server. So we're going to go over both Twitch and uh, manually or Java Edition or whatever. Uh, I don't use Technic, I think Technic is a little bit uh, funky. And I think some of their mod packs are broken, so I don't typically go with there. But first, we're going to have to talk about what you need in order to do more than 1.5 gigs. So, a little bit of history. Um, back in the day, right, if you go to your PC and you go to local disk, you have your program files 86 and your program files. So, back in the day, we had 32-bit and 64-bit processors. Well, back in the day we only had 32-bit. Uh, once the new age came around, we started getting 64-bit processors. And back in the day, 32-bit processors only allowed for about a gig and a half to allow to allocate. And once we got to 64-bit processors, that's when we were able to expand and widen and strengthen our cores in order for them to support more than 1.5, etc. So when you download Minecraft on a 32-bit system, that's why sometimes you get the error that says, hey, you can't run this mod pack because you need more than 1.5 gigs. It's because your computer is telling you that you don't have 64-bit installed and or it's not recognizing it. So this has a very, very simple fix. Simply go to Java, or in Java download, uh, that's what I would search up. Go ahead and download free software hit java download it'll take you to this page and just go ahead and hit see all java downloads and you want to download windows offline 64 bit you want to run it and you want to install it and it might ask you to delete something go ahead and hit ok that's perfectly fine it's just deleting the old system software and you'll get the new one right in there and it'll work so once you have that installed you should be able to go to we'll start with twitch first since i think that's easier so all you have to do when you're on this page just go ahead and hit your profile picture minus 5x official and it's a little balloon and hit settings and just go ahead and hit minecraft and if you scroll down a little bit you'll see that you can allocate more or less ram so i can get all the way up here or all the way down and i set around four to five gigs to this it just kind of depends it's what you really want and make sure you're using the native launcher or else you won't be able to start up the mod pack. That's a weird glitch you get with um, uh, Twitch launcher sometimes, especially jar launcher. So that's literally how you do that. That's pretty simple. Uh, you literally get this nice little scroll bar and it'll automatically do it for you. Um, Java is a little bit different, uh, but it's not hard at all. You just have to go to installations and hit these three little buttons here and hit edit and more options and you'll see JVM arguments right here so this simply tells you how much you can allocate to it none of this matters all you want to look at is this this is the file size that it starts at I have it currently set as 2 gigs and if I simply just change it to 5 gigs and I hit save and I go ahead and edit it again and look down at it you'll see that it saved us 5 gigs when I play Minecraft it'll launch it and I will have 5 gigs dedicated to it so it's a really simple thing that you guys can do even if you're struggling with I can't allocate more than 1.5 gigs downloading Java is super easy and it's free. and I believe it works on Mac too and this whole system works on Mac as well so you don't have to worry about that, but uh, yeah, this was a short tutorial on how to do some simple things with some glitches. Some people get like, oh, I don't have enough RAM to launch Minecraft, or I don't have enough RAM, or how do I allocate more RAM? And uh, yeah, I hope I covered this well. You can see up here, it says 691 at 5120, which means that I installed 5 gigs onto it, and that means that it's running that perfectly well. So if you did enjoy, uh, please give this video a like, uh, comment down below, think, say hey I loved it, hey I hated it, 
you know, it doesn't matter to me. It's just all about helping you guys. And if you have any questions, please ask. But if you did enjoy, like, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.